The head of India's coronavirus task force, Dr. V. K. Paul, warned that India is inching closer to a third wave and that the next 100 to 125 days is most critical in ensuring that a possible third wave is not as intense as the one witnessed before in April May. The Niti Aayog member Health said that India was yet to achieve herd immunity and any neglect in COVID appropriate behaviour could lead to a third wave that causes widespread infection once again. The virus is still around. Some localities, districts and states have more burden. So we need to be careful in this direction because any additional outbreak may happen. Our decline is slow. This is a warning for us. The situation is as of now under control, but it may worsen in the future. However, it is in our hands to maintain this situation, Dr. V.K. Paul said. Officials stress that states demarcate micro-containment zones and lift restrictions in a calibrated manner, while at the same time ramping up vaccinations. They also reminded people not to become complacent. The Indian Council of Medical Research had earlier said that a third wave is likely by the end of August. Meanwhile, a new study commissioned by the ICMR has shown that about 1 in 10 people who caught the coronavirus infection after being vaccinated required admission to hospital for treatment of the disease. Crucially, none of those admitted to hospital required ventilator or oxygen support and none had to be admitted into the ICU. Dr. Samiran Panda, head of ICMR's Epidemiology and Communicable Diseases Division, was quoted by the Indian Express saying, This is highly significant and underlines the crucial role of vaccines in reducing severity of the disease and mortality. Subscribe to One India channel and never miss an update.